Hello and welcome back to Pyre. I am Lazy Bones. I don't remember what we did on the last episode, so let's just continue. Uh, it's been a while since I last played, by the way, so if I'm a little rusty, I'm sorry. Uh, Falcon, run. Goblin? Okay, goblin voice. Uh, <laughs> oh, hey, guys. Fancy running into you, this side of the sand. So what can I do for you? <laughs> Rookie, I hate this user. Oh, well, how'd you make it all this way ahead of us? The Tower of Polyflesh. Ah, come on now, Mr. Greentail. Can't just give up all my business secrets, am I right? What I can do, though, seeing as you've been such a good customer at all, is provide for you a sim sample of a little something something you might like. Here, check this out. Seeing as you bought that moon crest finger from me last time, why, I'm just thinking you could use this, and I got more, if you want. You receive a pinch of stardust. It does seem useful. A pinch of stardust kind of looks a little like something you might snort. <laughs> and something you'd call it, too. Interact with Ron to quiet him down. <laughs> Okay. Oh wow, we just kind of smacked him to sleep. Was that it? Oh, wait, how much gold? I have 71 gold. Oh yeah. What can I get? What's this? A lucrative contract. Rank 10, talisman. Effect, after banishing an adversary, the bear gains plus one gold? Up to, hit, to up to as many times per right. Ten. Hmm. Lunar glass. While carrying the orb, the bearer. Oh, it's 200. Never mind. I'm not even going to read that. 50. Yeah, we get, when uh, plunging into the adversary's pyre, the bearer deals bonus damage. Ah, at the start of a right, the bearer's pyre automatically gains plus seven. All very good, but I don't want to talk to me. Uh, maybe some other time, then guys. What, was I supposed to buy something? Oh no, did I screw something up? They're back again, Dad. This is, this is mine, right? Yeah, this is mine. This is another one. Oh, confirm transaction. Proceed. Oh, there we go. We were supposed to do that. Okay. Ha! Ah, I knew you were going to like that stuff. Guys, it's pretty... <laughs> Who knew what I mean? Wait, know what I mean? And if you want some more now, I know just the individual and his dad who can get it. Catch my meaning? Yeah. Just stop on by some other time. Fantastic. I'm gonna take this. You mean I have to do this every single time? Oh, I have to wear it. Plus 10, huh? They're leaving, Dad. Just look at how much we got this time. Commence the night. <laughs> you and your fellow exiles. Exiles? Exiles. Gather around the sacred site known as the Carrier Urn of Hoab. <laughs> Anticipating the hour that the rites 
are to commence again. Siren? Siren? According to the stars, the next rite shall soon commence here. Let's go. Oh, all is quiet for a time. And then... <laughs> oh, they moly. A rock and roll dog. From out of nowhere, charges in a gangly cur. He stops short and gives you a mighty sneer. Psst. Psst. That's... Oh, that's Barker Ashpaw. Real piece of work. Just don't make eye contact. Barker Ash paws. He is a troublemaking cur who thrills in the defeat of the triumvirates who stand against him. Oi! Well, would you look at this lot? Even got one of our own. Consorting with the two leggers. You're a disgrace there, mate. You realize? Uh, good to see you, Barker. You're looking well. Didn't know you knew about the rights. Oi, I know about a lot of things, my friend. For instance, I know you're going to be very, very sad after we wipe the floor with you here. Don't know whose back you scratch to earn yourself a spot on the high and mighty night wings. There, but I'm gonna make sure all of you regret it. Because why not? <laughs> Sounds good. Sounds good. The cur Parker laughs away as his pack stumbles after him. You hear them howling and cackling as the stars above begin to glow. Oh boy. Come on the night! to the splendors of the accursed cairn of Ha'oub. You shall find ha the downside grows less pleasant from this point. But first, there's a tradition to uphold. This time you stand against the dissidents. Even now they hunger to defeat you. Perhaps not simply to regain their freedom, but to deny you yours. Aw, oh, yeah. <laughs> oh boy, oh boy. As the stars shine down upon you, the pack of curs, you stand against this night, continue hooting and hauling, howling. The pack of curs, you? The pack of curs, you stand Okay, that didn't sound right at first. Okay. Oi, come on, you lot. Let's boil some blood. Then Rookie pulls you aside. Um, look, Chop. I don't know how to say this, but I got. I can't go against these guys. Just trust me on this one, okay? You sense he means it. You make a mental note to ask about his history with Barker whenever he time permits. It's alright, Rookie. We can take care of them. Oh, this guy's in my crew, too? Begging your pardon, but if you need another to stand at your side this night, I have someone here whom I would recommend. Do not be coy with us, minstrel. Don the robes if you intend to stand with us. Ah, uh, I did not mean myself. The rights are not for me. I was instead referring to this little one. A, cre a creature wearing tiny remnants appears at the lone minstrel's side. Hmm. Ski he he. Oh, I should have. Oh, damn it. Absurd. The imp knows the rights. 
Zelda. He knows a good deal. So long as the bike wings stand together, he shall be at their side. Though you need not take my word for it. Tizo, our adversaries seem to be preoccupied. Perhaps you might quickly show our comrades what you can do. The little imp peers at you. You sense his connection to the rites as he awaits your guidance. Oh, there we go. See, Tizo seems excited to demonstrate some of his favorite tricks. Liaratus. Rita, influencing Tizo may take some getting used to. He is inviting you to try. Another joins your ranks. And a mere imp. Oh. oh. No, it cannot be. And we zip. shall see what comes of this new partnership of yours. Oh, okay. I see. <laughs> okay. That's nice. Hold B to implode. Wow. Tizo soon returns after imploding. Press Y to proceed. Well done, as ever, Tizo. Squawk. Tizo is happy to lend his support during the rites, if you could use his help. Well then, Rita. Who shall conduct the rites in the name of the Nightwings? Who shall conduct this rite? Oh, equip a lucrative contract in your cargo. Oh, I'm not gonna use... Oh, wait, yes, I am gonna use this guy. I don't know what it's for, but we're doing it. And uh, I'm gonna choose him. Edwin! Got it, stop. I'm gonna choose her. What's this do? Raises the rank of certain talismans plus one. Ah, oh, she doesn't have a talisman. Oh no! She's my tank lady. Jodariel. Jodariel. That's how you say her name. Jodariel. Ah, and this is the lady. Uh, interact. Okay, good. And this goes what here? Whoa. What did I just do? Oh! Oh! Plus one. Oh, was it a six and now it's a seven? I didn't catch that. But we're not gonna use her. We're gonna use this guy. Oh, quick, this is terrible. Let's take this off her. This guy. This. Here. And I'm gonna do it again. Let's see. Oh, there it is. Oh. Oh. oh I like that. Tizo. The oh, choice is cast. Sad. It's so sad when he said that. Tears are our our adversaries shall be quick. Be ready. I know they're really fast. Time's up, you swile. Come on, boys. Let's get him. Huh? Oh, no. Commence. Engulfed within the aura. Oh, no, I forgot how to run. Oh, I can move it? What? What the hell did it just... Oh, no. One almost got sprint, 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 X. No, that's not X. Let's jump. Sprint, sprint, sprint. sprint. RB! Uh. Oh, that's. Someone there Somebody. rose to the occasion. This isn't good. I forgot how to blur. Sprint. RT, sprint. Fudge. It was dangerously close. <laughs> this is 
sucks. No one's getting anywhere. To each his own. Uh, wind, throw it in. Oh my gosh. Jeez, that was tough. What a pass. Seize the orb. A stroke of luck is all. Ah. Uh. Oh! Ooh. <laughs> Supposed to be there to defend the Dario. Alright, run. Start. Ooh, wow, what a nice interception. Why, that was oh. all of them. So. A banishment. Oh, -ho. Edwin flung the orb into the flame. <sighs> Man, this is getting harder. <laughs> A weak attempt, and yet it hit the mark. <laughs> Glorious. <sighs> I'm losing him for a round, so that's not good. The orb flies true. Oh yeah. All right, you lot. Well, that does it. No more fussing around, right? My boys and me, we're gonna. We're proper angry now. <laughs> oh my gosh, Max, it's terrible. <laughs> Holy moly, what the heck? Run! Careful now. Your adversary Barker there seems oh. to but a little splash. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Angry, now, huh? Go on, just once more. Oh, we can't like do like some sort of Super Saiyan battle thing. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> the orb quenches the flame. Dang. Oh. Throw it. Oh, he's going to catch it. Oh. Never mind. Wow. What? Oh, my gosh. Pass, 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 pass. Pass. Nope. Jump out of the way. Unfortunate. Mm. Are you no effing kidding me with this? Ah. Oh. Oh my gosh, one more score. Ugh. Oh, we caught it. These guys are really good. Wow.
What the? Ah. Jump. Oh. Pathetic. Your pyre sputters. The orb is up. And it is done. Oh. The night wings prevail yet again. That was the close. The flames of their resolve could not be doused. It was way too close. I do not like Thus that little bird. This night's proceedings. Speed is the name of the game. And everybody here was so slow. Alright. That ought to show them. Perhaps now they shall learn some humility. Well, well. I'll be a heaping ball of dung. But I just can't believe... You shoddy lot showed us the what for, like that. My boys and I will have to take you just a tad more seriously next time. Till then, you just be sure to tell old Rookie Greentail that yours truly, he remembers everything, you hear? The right do tend to teach something of trust. We did it. I can't believe we did it. I think I'm beginning to understand something of all my friends. Choose a mastery for Hedwig. Let's see, gains a plus 50 more stamina. Letting him jump and sprint more often. Hedwin and his allies regenerate stamina twice as quickly as usual. Uh, this one, the please. The Master General reveals his stratagem. Witness the rites firsthand and be inspired. Oh. Enlightenment seldom avails itself to simple imps. Tizzo feels solemn respect for the rites and all their myriad complexities. Same thing, right? Oh. Same symbols, different things. While fluttering or zipping, Tizo moves much faster than usual. If banished, Tizo drops a moon sign allies can instantly transport to from their pyre. Tis Speed. the influence of the imp scribe. Is that it? Oh, we can go back now. Until the next oh. right. A lone minstrel. Splendid was your guidance of the night wings, reader. Your fellows are fortunate to have such to have found one such as you. May my uh, may you find the freedom that you seek. There we go. That's how you read it. I think I'm gonna call it here, guys. This has been fun. A really good episode. Ah, uh, but uh, that's it. I'm calling it. I'm not reading anything more that pops up. Thank you so much. So, so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. I certainly did. And see you on the next one. Take care of yourselves. This is Pyre. I am Lazy Birds. <laughs> and uh, again, see you in the next one. Bye-bye.